When it comes to love, do you keep striking out? It's probably more my fault that I'm not meeting people than Gainesville's fault. <laughs> While we sure hope not, a new survey says Gainesville is one of the prime spots to find a date. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Take it from Ray and Evelyn Hopkins. They met in Gainesville. In 1972. 1972. And have been together ever since. We fell in love and got married, and this October we celebrate our 40th anniversary. So why here? I would say all the young people. There are definitely a lot of people here, and they're all pretty nice. Good downtown area for everybody to get together. The hot weather is always conducive to people, you know, romancing, so maybe it has to do with the weather year round. Maybe, but the Daily Beast ranked Gainesville at number two based on dating costs, the mental and physical health of the people who live here, and the amount of men and women on the market. The final count, about 73% of men and 75% of women here in Gainesville are riding solo. So where can you find them? I mean, there are a lot of bars downtown, so I suppose you could go there. I'm not really sure what you would find. <laughs> Movies. Go out to the movies and the bookstores. We like to come to downtown Gainesville, really. Just walk around out here, go to restaurants. Sound advice, just in time for Valentine's Day. Kimberly Howard, GTN News, working for you.